Hey guys, I'm just 35 here, and today we've got another old base video for you guys to take a look at. Yeah, so here we go. You can see a guy. He's doing stuff. It looks like he's going to shoot people. But, yep, so this is the base. There's some water. You know, there's some battle droids. There are some clone troopers as well. You know, all the fun stuff you'd kind of expect in one of these videos are, are mostly here. You know, somewhat bad camera quality. Check. Random stuff that probably shouldn't exist. Check. Really poor base design. We got it all. Check. And basically no battlefield detail. Also check. So, very good. As you can see, there's some stuff going on here. I guess we're going to take a look at this guy in more detail. Um, as you can see, he exists. Very cool. Definitely a very cool figure. Does not overuse studs at all. Is not bland in the slightest. Definitely not. So, that is that. But hopefully now we'll move on to some of the other things, like the ATRT right there, and the various clone troopers, including Captain Rex out there, and there's a bark speeder as well. So very good, I, I guess. We'll see. Um, yeah, there's a Sharpie custom getting grabbed. I don't know what this thing is, but. It's a custom thing, so yay, and then there's this bomb squad trooper who looks like he's being grabbed by that same thing as well, so that's interesting, but you know, other than that, not really a whole lot going on over there. So now we'll go over here, and there's some battle droids, one of them can't cross this river because he'll get wet and die probably, and then there are some other battle droids over there that have crossed the river somehow, and yeah, and then there's that dude has like electricity or something I don't I don't know what's going on maybe it's like a taser cannon I guess we'll take a look at him and find out but yep there we go very interesting looking weapon don't know how practical it is <laughs> with the huge bar sticking out of the side but you know it looks interesting at the least and you know sometimes it's as good as you get with these sorts of things so I guess we'll just keep staring at that bark speeder and the desk and such um so yeah there's the droid getting tasered um and then there's some clones shooting and then there's actually some blood in this mock so don't know how that happens because the sort of laser bolts like tend to cauterize the wound immediately after they hit you because they're so hot but you know there's blood so i'm not going to ask any questions maybe he was stabbed by the other weird thing um but there's my desk you know it's a desk, and I'm, looks like I'm moving stuff to show off a sliding door, which does not surprise me in the slightest, because pretty much all the old bases, if they did do one thing right, they all had a sliding door, so that's what we'll take a look at now. You can see it's kind of a mountain base. Here's the kind of the doorway, just kind of a cutout in the mountain, as you can see there. This is an eight, eight stud wide door, I guess. You can say brick or stud, doesn't really matter, but slides on the tiles, as we'll see in a second, hopefully. Um, so, you know, it looks like I'm reaching around the back, look in the corner, and... Okay, not what I was expecting, but, you know, we can get it open. Just not, not very well, but it does open. Um, hopefully it opens more than that. <laughs> um, but... Maybe not, you know? I, I don't know. Um, probably, hopefully opens more than that, but of course there's no way of telling because, you know, this is an old base and it's not like it's on my table next to me or something like that. So I guess we'll just look at the Sharpie custom getting grabbed, um, which is interesting as I reset kind of the battlefield. I don't really know what I was going for with that. Um, I don't really honestly care too much at this point because this does not exist anymore and I honestly would not be surprised if this thing got disassembled after this video but there it is so very interesting droid thing there so now we're back in business it looks like um, the camera's moving around so hopefully we'll get a look at the interior of this base next and yep there we are there's the interior um, it does look like there's not enough room for it to slide anymore uh, actually, yeah, there is a bit more room. There's some crates behind where the door slides, so I guess that's cool. You have some panels, which have some chairs behind them, so you can have some clones working on some panels. And there's a clone who looks like he's running away from the panels to 
probably go aid the battle outside, but uh, who's to say? Um, so that's that. You can see my desk again. There's another clone working on some panels over here next to the bark speeder. That's kind of what's going on right there. Um, so now we're back and the camera's been blinded, which which is good. Um, so, yeah. Um, maybe there's more? Doubt it, but we'll just have to wait and see. So, probably that's the entire base. It's a little, little I hesitate to call it a mountain base because it's really not that tall, but it's like a hill base with rocks um, instead of like grass or anything. So, yeah. That is the base, I, I think. Um, we're just kind of going around looking at random stuff at this point. So, yeah, um, that's going to wrap up this video. Thanks, everybody, so much for watching this old base video. Let me know what you think of this down in the comments section below and all that fun stuff. So, yeah, I'm just going to let the footage play out. Thanks, everybody, so much for watching, because I don't think there will be anything really important to cover in these last few seconds of the footage. And, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.